from Jerusalem, I want to share with you a teaching about Hanukkah and the earth. When Jacob returned to the land of Israel, his brother Esau came with 400 men with the intention to kill Jacob. So before that encounter, Jacob moves his family to the other side of the stream. And strangely, Jacob went back to the other side of the stream and remained alone. The sages of the Talmud explain that Jacob went back for his small vessels. A Hasidic rabbi, Rabbi Eliezer of Jacob, in his book, the Imre Noam, explains that Jacob went back to recover some olive oil that was in those vessels. That was a very special olive oil because it had come from the olive oil that Noah pressed from the olive branch that the dove brought after the flood. Noah then gave that olive oil to his son Shem, who passed it through the generations, to Abraham, and then to Isaac, and then to Jacob. And following this encounter with Esau, Jacob brought that olive oil to Jerusalem and left it and hid it at the site of the Holy Temple that would be built in the future, and that was the olive oil that was the source of the miracle of Hanukkah. In our times, we're facing very significant environmental challenges. I think that this teaching can connect and relate in two ways. First, because the greatest renewable energy available on the planet is spiritual energy, and by connecting to, to that and being reminded of, of that during Hanukkah, we can actually help to address some of the root causes of the environmental crisis. And second of all, by using olive oil, which is a renewable energy, a, renew a renewable resource, we can help to wean ourselves from fossil fuels and remind us of the importance of using renewable energy and of hopefully increasing the light in this world. Hanukkah Sameach.